The Journey Within by me, Carol Ann Henderson. Did these waves of emotion rise up from a turbulent sea of salty tears? Or a pure water glistening sun shower divined from the heavens above? Has the river of passion overcome your heart as it met with the ocean? Stream sirens and lake fairies may ask, Did you know that water is love? In this sunlit, magical day of aloneness with yourself, In quiet stillness, were you able to hear the whispering voices of flowers in the breeze? Did you know that all the answers to life's more significant concerns rest in tall grass, flower petals, and the rings and hollows of the elder trees? Tempests occur to test our grit, wisdom, and capacity for gracious yielding. Dark, placid waters carry the rolling moonlight of love to lure us more deeply in, yet resisting the stormy vortex of overwhelmingly dramatic emotions is where the flight of freedom from a disorienting inner imbalance will begin. Beyond how harmoniously natural elements coexist within the scope of heaven, the love of God is in the water and in the sky, as well as in the lay of the land. We must realize how effectively we quietly ensure respect without demands, not raising a voice, a weapon, anger, a concern, or doubt, or even a command. Thinking about the long road my character and I have traveled has presented a more audible picture of the changes that occurred. Not the outward kind. We are all bound to notice in an instant. But rather the ever-evolving nuances of the spirit being, being heard. Beyond the veil of emotion, in the clear water pool of the soul, glistens in the sunlight of a wholesome goodness and purity. Where revealed through the thicket and bramble of life are the exquisite virtues of childlike innocence and humility.
We are all here longing for a sense of belonging and of being wanted. The dreams we like to share in the real life manifestation of. We hope to dive more deeply into a rewarding soulful journey as we respond to one another with a real warmth of true love. Should the waters of another be cool yet clear and refreshing, should they be calming warm sunlit and safe plus inviting? If they run deep and dark and mysteriously alluring too, take a chance since a new love is different and exciting. If you don't swim too deep, it'll be easy to come up out of, but if you do, you'd better be a mighty strong swimmer, since embarking on a journey into the caverns of another soul is never safe for a serial dabbler, player, or skittish beginner. Mainly, you have a little voice inside, perhaps a sound of reason. God, your instincts, guardian angels, spirit guides, or intuition. They make your heart smile or can cause your mind to question. They are the sacred inner voices to which you must positively always Listen. Yes, water is love and the exploration it's a fine one of self and of other. Treasures and oddities are sure to surface and be uncovered. Obstacles to overcome and riches to be unearthed will abound. Remembering it is all a gift, no matter what you have discovered. Embarking on this perpetually spiritual, personal soul's journey, I'm blessed to share the beauty of my magical reality with you. Born into humanity with an intelligent heart and loving mind, I wish the same joy and love in the journey within for you. on the journey within for you.